What I appreciate most about the Minnesota Oral Health Coalition is that you bring so many people across Minnesota in dental care together to work together to improve access to dental care, especially for those in need. I also really appreciate the day at the Capitol that we collaborate on um, together with your great support. And uh, we're just very grateful that this uh, Minnesota Oral Health Coalition is supported by Delta Dental of Minnesota Foundation and is such a resource to those in Minnesota who need access to dental care and those who provide that care. Thank you very much. Hi, my name is Chris Haugen and I was the uh, communications coordinator for MDH as Nancy got the Oral Health Coalition started. Uh, we worked together for about a year trying to uh, figure out how to keep moving this project forward. Um, much to Nancy's great success, um, it's been 10 years. I'm happy to know that this group has continued to form and do important things for the world of oral health um, in the state of Minnesota. Congratulations. Happy 10th anniversary, Minnesota Oral Health Coalition and greetings from Virginia. I'm Sarah Holland. I'm the CEO of Virginia Health Catalyst and I wanna thank you for everything that you've done to make Minnesotans healthier, but also all of the things that you've done to make all of the oral health coalitions across the nation stronger and better. Thanks, here's to 10 more. Hello, this is Matt Jacob, Public Health Communications Consultant. Over the years, I've had several brief collaborations with your coalition, and each time I felt energized and inspired. You know, these days we hear a lot of talk about servant leadership, but from my observation, the coalition's leaders have always modeled that principle diligently, quietly. Your coalition thinks big, works hard, and holds itself accountable along the way. So congratulations on your 10 year anniversary. And I want you to know I'm expecting very big things over your next 10 years. Congrats. Director of Northern Dental Access Center. Congratulations to the Minnesota Oral Health Coalition on your 10 year anniversary. I remember fondly those early days with the flip chart and the post-it notes when a shared vision for the organization emerged. I'm so proud to have been a part of it. Nancy, you are the best and thanks to everyone who has made the coalition such a success. Hi everyone, this is Dana, Mike, and Fonsuda. We're at the University of Minnesota School of Dentistry on the Dental Patient Reported Outcomes Research Team. We wanted to shout out the thanks to the Minnesota All Health Coalition. The coalition gave us an opportunity to present our research findings at the Medical Dental Integration Conference. It was inspiring to meet like-minded people and to create new partnerships. Thank you. Congratulations on the 10 year anniversary. We're looking forward to seeing what we can accomplish together the next 10 years. Bye. Congratulations to the Minnesota Oral Health Coalition on celebrating its 10th anniversary. And especially thanks to Nancy Frank Wilson for her leadership in this effort. Uh, and I'm looking forward to the next 10 years of what this organization can do. Most importantly, it's great to see all of the Minnesota oral health leaders uh, working to improve the oral health of all Minnesotans. I want to wish the Minnesota Oral Health Coalition a happy birthday, happy 10th birthday. I am always reminded of Margaret Mead's uh, quote when I uh, work with and think about the Minnesota Oral Health Coalition. Never doubt that a small group of thoughtful, committed citizens can change the world. Indeed, it's the only thing that ever has. And that's uh, what I feel like we're celebrating with the Minnesota Oral Health Coalition. And I'm Sheila Riggs and a happy uh, member uh, for ten, all 10 years. Thank you. Hi, I'd like to create this tribute to the Oral Health Network. This is Jenny Oliphant. Through the Oral Health Network, I met my research partner now, Eileen Crespo, and through the, that meeting, we have gone on to do a lot of really important uh, research that I think is affecting the oral health world, and I appreciate so much the support of the Oral Health Network. Thank you. Congratulations on your 10 years. Uh I'm just really excited. I'm Dr. Michael Helgeson. I'm the CEO at Apple Tree Dental, and I've been involved with the 
Minnesota Oral Health Coalition since its birth. And I want to turn it over to Deb Jacoby, our policy director, to share some uh, memories and thanks to the Oral Health Coalition. Deb? Thank you, Dr. Helgeson. So Nancy and the board and the members of the Oral Health Coalition, congratulations on a decade of impact. Uh, I remember being on the initial appointed board and talking with specifically Ann Johnson from Delta Dental and Diane Benjamin from the Otto Bremer Foundation about how important it was that we had oral health leadership representing everyone across the state and bringing folks together. And they got it that the only way we would do that was if we had a dynamic executive director uh, to lead all uh, of our efforts. And thank goodness for you, Nancy, and for the coalition between the oral health showcases at the Capitol that bridge uh, all of the stakeholders in oral health to the medical dental integration conversations and the policy implications of that uh, to the policy and learning committee. Uh, you have just done so much and we are so grateful for all of your efforts, including being an allied organization with uh, CAD Minnesota, the Critical Access uh, Dental Association of Minnesota. Thank you. Congratulations. Can't wait to see what you do in the next 10 years. And with that, I'll turn it over to Jess. I am Jess Flaudrude. I'm the Chief Strategic Officer here at Apple Tree and a big happy 10 year anniversary to the coalition, Nancy, everybody who served on the board and all of the members, because all of the members have done so much to uh, move the needle on getting access to dental care to many who wouldn't have it otherwise. I'm so grateful uh, that the coalition can provide the opportunity for us all to connect and not just from the dental field, right? We need everybody from all sectors to come together to really make a difference. And um, thanks to these collaborations, we are making faster progress in expanding that access to dental care. So. Again, happy anniversary, like Deb said, so excited to see what uh, is to come in the next 10 years. Uh, and I guess Emma? Hi, uh, I'm Emma Larson. I'm the communications director for Apple Tree Dental. And as the um, only person speaking here from Apple Tree who has been in the dental world for um, fewer than 10 years, I guess I don't know uh, what everything was like before the Oral Health Coalition um, was founded, but uh, I really appreciate all the efforts that the coalition does, especially with communications, being that that's in my wheelhouse. Um, the newsletters are so helpful, and also all of the um, social media resources that the coalition puts out are amazing for helping all the organizations that rely on the coalition and um, associate with the coalition to be a part of a bigger community and to put on that united front um, so that we can all indicate that we are all in the same boat and going towards oral health for everybody. So um, thank you very much for all of the efforts that go into all the communication work along with everything else that the coalition does and congratulations on 10 years. Thanks Emma and again uh, just on behalf of all 300 Apple Tree uh, board and staff members I just want to thank the coalition, thank all of its members and, and congratulate uh, Nancy on 10 years of extraordinary leadership. Thanks a bunch. On to the next 10 years. Hello, my name is Clarence Jones. I'm the executive director of the Human Partnership, and I am excited to be able to uh, do this small video uh, to celebrate the Minnesota Oral Health Coalition's 10th anniversary. And uh, just a special thanks to Nancy Frank E. Wilson, uh, who has uh, been working with us for the last, uh, at least the last four years on community health issues. One of the things that I've appreciated most about um, the organization has been its willingness to uh, participate with us as we do community outreach. There have been times where I've gone to them and I've asked them for assistance in, in terms of maybe getting some uh, uh, toothbrushes or some other kind of oral health issues and Nancy has uh, been more than willing to do that. As a community organization, I look forward to the opportunity to, to work even more closely with you 
uh, as we address the issue of oral health in our community. I know it's a very uh, important issue because there's so many things that are affected by our, our oral health. And so I'm really glad again to be able to, to, to provide this short video to just say thank you for what you're doing and we look forward to continually working with you in the future. Have a great day. I am Sarah Wovcha, the Director of Children's Dental Services, and I've had the honor and privilege of being a part of the Minnesota Oral Health Coalition since its inception and serving as its president when we hired Nancy Frank Wilson 10 years ago. She has been a force of nature. I have to say, I am just so incredibly grateful. She has grown MOHC beyond what we ever imagined. And today, what MOHC means to me is it is the glue that holds the Minnesota oral health community together. Thank you so much, Nancy, and so many congratulations to MOHC. Hi, I'm Frances Conrad Wolfja, and since I was six years old, I've heard from my mom about the Minnesota Oral Health Coalition and Nancy Frank Wilson. I know she's a strong woman leader making our community healthier, and now that I'm 16, I personally appreciate MOHC advocating for things that are important to teen oral health, like HPV vaccinations. Thank you, MOHC, for making Minnesota healthier for me. Hi, my name is Chris Gelb and I work with the Minnesota Oral Health Project. I was introduced to the Minnesota Oral Health Coalition by our founder, Dr. Amos Dinard, when I was still trying to figure out the role of a public health nurse in dental health. It took no time at all, and I was introduced to some important players in Minnesota's dental health. I found out about other agencies that were doing wonderful work in dental health, and I was provided with resources I could use every day in my work and this has continued. What I like best about the Minnesota Oral Health Coalition, it doesn't matter who I'm working with or what I'm working on, I can have Nancy and the coalition on speed dial and find an answer to my question, an idea to try, or a solution that will help me in my work. I think Minnesota is very fortunate to have the Minnesota Oral Health Coalition, and I hope they'll be around a lot longer. Thank you. My name is Connie Bai. I'm one of the founding members of the Minnesota Oral Health Coalition, and it's really exciting to be part of the celebration of 10 years of promoting optimal oral health for Minnesotans. I think my favorite memories are of the grassroots effort at the very beginning when people from around the state came together and that passion and planning and support from funders help the coalition get to where it is today. Here's to 10 more years and beyond to the Oral Health Coalition. Hi everyone, my name is Nancy Frank Wilson. I have the distinct privilege and honor of serving as the executive director of the Minnesota Oral Health Coalition. What do I appreciate the most about our Minnesota Oral Health Coalition? Hands down, without giving it a thought, it's the people. Our membership, our board of directors, all of the people that have served in leadership, our partners, really too, too great in numbers and names to, to say here, um, and especially our friendship and partnership with the Delta Dental Minnesota Foundation, who have supported us from the very beginning, uh, before there was a coalition, standing up and saying, no, we want this and we're going to support this. 
And what have I gotten from the Minnesota Oral Health Coalition? You know, this is, this is where I get emotional. Um, what I have gotten from the coalition, from its people, its partners, I've learned so much. I've learned about motivation and creativity and caring for others. I've learned so much about dental. It's changed my perspective on what I thought I understood about public health. Um, there's just so much and professionally and personally I've grown. I've grown from working with all of you and from learning from you. And I just want to say thank you. Thank you a million times. And I'm so proud of us. I'm proud of all of you that got this started before I was even a part of it. And I'm proud of all of us that have kept it going and watched it grow and develop. And I look forward to seeing what happens in the next 10 years. And hopefully 100 years from now, somebody's having a party and they're celebrating this occasion and they're celebrating what all of you did 10 plus years ago to get it started. So let's celebrate. Let's celebrate. Thank you, everybody.